Welcome, I'm Egypt Burge, your self-care specialist and host of the Nourish Your Soul online retreat. Today, our featured guest is Mary L. McCarthy, founder and chief inspiration officer of createrightnow.com. Mary is also the author of Journaling Power, How to Create the Happy, Healthy Life You Want to Live, which is an international bestseller. Through the power of journaling, Mary has transformed her own life, discovered her true self, and uncovered hidden talents. Mary offers guidance, support, and inspiration through her online offerings, ebooks, and private consultation. Welcome, Mary. Good morning, Egypt. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Thanks for asking. What are some of the challenges that people have about journaling? And I, I would imagine that, you know, because writing is something that has been, that is, that growing up, we often submit it and have it critiqued and criticized. And, you know, you get it back and you have these red marks on your paper. You have all these, you know, the grammatical errors that need to be changed. And, and, um, and that's what we're used to. We're used to submitting our writing for, um, to, you know, often for correction um, and for review. And then with journaling, it is so personal. So I would imagine that uh, people would have some, some challenges with getting used to, to writing just for themselves, because that's not, that's not what we commonly do. Can you speak to that a little bit? Oh, definitely. And I call it um, uh, page fright. You know, how the, the, the writers, you know, the, the real writers call it, you know, writer's block, but I call it page fright because, I, you know, based on my experience, it's, it's just like, it's really fears. It's really the, the fears that, as we were saying about so many things, we're literally carrying around in the cells of our, our being. So, and it's just, you know, and it, it takes a while to, to figure out, you know, where's that feeling coming from? Where's yeah. that? Yeah, so it's, um, so the whole thing about, and, and that's what, to me, it's like, I got really, really scared uh, uh, after I was doing the morning pages for a while and all that kind of stuff, and I thought, oh, maybe I'll, I'll just go back to the computer and, and keep my journal on the computer, and it's just like, no, <laughs> there, there's like, oh, how boring. <laughs> but then, and again, uh, synchronistically, shall I say, um, I came across a, a book by a lady by the name of Emily Hamlin. It was the art of fiction writing. She introduced the whole concept of the inner critic. This the whole thing. The the focus again was has always been on left brain and you know doing it right and, and mm -hmm. making sure you, you you know you use a uh, oh, a, a period uh, as opposed to using a semicolon. So, like I said earlier. Okay, so I mean, so I, I can tell you all the states and their capitals. And I can tell you, you know, what, what's the difference between a, you know, a dangling participle and a gerund and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> it's just like, but it's like, it's, we're talking about creative writing, you know, yeah. so, uh, so it, it, it's, it's something, uh, uh, as, as I said, uh, the bottom line is it's fear of all mm. shapes and sizes. <laughs> so yeah, I'm, I'm hearing that, that fear and then is, um, is a big factor. And then noticing that when we're we're hearing other voices that we're constantly being we're critical of ourselves and and just getting past that can actually open up a whole new world for ourselves. But I also heard you mention the guilt of making time for yourself as well. Having to first have the conversation about what journaling is, you know, mm -hmm. about, you know about really getting into to you and your soul and your heart and your emotions and, and things like that. That's the thing of, oh, I'm just so busy, I'm so stressed, and all that, all that, that type of thing. So I don't have time. The way you are choosing to live your life right now, you don't have time for yourself. This journaling presents you a real opportunity for you to create time in your life for you. And that's a you know, something you probably never done before. The whole thing of time is definitely a real uh, thing because of the way you know we've been running our alignment. Like I said, it's it's, it's really we're really changing from as I like to say, living uh, on the periphery of our life, and we're really journaling helps us learn how to live our life from the inside out. And that's major, major behavior. Absolutely. 
it's going to really require a mindset change. Right? Oh, to, definitely. Yeah, to um, to know that you are, I guess, worthy enough to to take time to yourself and to make yourself a priority. Um, just giving yourself a few minutes of downtime to write and reflect can, and and then but the benefits of it I mean are just to have those eye opening moments that can change your life it's extraordinary yes it's extraordinary. yes and, and, and realizing that the uh, who we who we have thought that we were or who we think we are and who we really are are two different, I mean, it's almost like a, a Jekyll and Hyde situation, you know, it's just like we've been living in our heads, you know, processing, the, but it's just mm-hmm. like journaling, we return to, to center and it's like, we discover all these things about, you know, uh, not only the, the physical, but the emotional and, and, and able to, like you say, reflect and take the time for ourselves and say, oh my goodness, oh, that, Oh, now I, and like I said, and, and have the, the ahas, and it's just like, you know, and, 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 and be able to have the laughter, and it's just like, you know, it's like the, the, the guy in the, the commercial, oh, I should have had, could have had a VA, VA. <laughs> that type of thing, and it's just like, I mean, to me, it's like, you know, when I, I remember some of the things from childhood, and it's like, oh my goodness, it's not that, you know, you know, I'm I'm dumb and stupid and all that kind of stuff, you know, because my, my brother is a uh does need sheet music to play the play, piano. He can just sit down and play uh, so but, but just going through all that thing just like mm-hmm. oh my gosh, I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a different type of of stupid. brilliant. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. Brilliant, yes. <laughs> What yeah. well, I'm thinking, one of the things that I love about journaling is that looking back on my journals mm-hmm. and I, I always have like these, those VA moments or those just, just like, wow, I have moments like how much I've changed or grown or, or, um, how things have come to fruition over, you know, things that I've written out and then how, how they actually happen, you know, things that I didn't think would happen. And, and it just actually can be inspiring just, um, just to look back and reflect on, on uh, things that I've written in the past. Oh, oh, definitely. And two, and like you say, the, the reflection and the, and, uh, in the perspective, uh, mm-hmm. just like, uh, and as you say, to, to see that, Wow, you, by uh, getting through all the garbage and sorting it out and, and getting clicks like it, you know, to me, it's awesome for, for goals. Or, yes. You know, and that's what, to me, uh, uh, and cause I, I had never consistently, you know, journaled uh, until I got into it, uh, like I said, 18 years ago. But I really find, too, that, boy, my, my go- I've always been a goal setter and, a, you know, I've always loved goals. And that, but now with a journal, it's, it gets, you know, things come fa- faster. And, and then, like you say, and going back to, oh, that's where that came from. Or, <laughs> you know, or, or don't you say, or to arbitrarily just take a look at, at something and say, oh, wow. You know, I, I knew that way back when, or I, I wrote right. that, you know, that kind of stuff. So, and it's just like, when the, you know, it's, not, it's, it's, it's really, yeah, like I said, exciting. And then, then you, you have, you have, uh, a hard and fast facts and to, to give yourself, wow, boy, have I grown or have I changed or, yeah. you know, or, or look how, how, you know, being more patient, you know, now benefit. It off. Yeah, exactly. So it's good. Cause I, you're right. Well, thank you, Miri. We appreciate all that you said today. And I'm actually um, planning to increase my journal time.